Hi Gemini, this is your channel messages for the 22nd of September. Are we? I think we're officially in Libra season. I think we're in Libra season now, Gemini, okay? Your fellow ear sign, okay? Your channel message is... Yo. Mm -hmm. Gemini. Let's do this. Pan bed, pan floor against wall. We f them hard to them Bali. I'm the girls, them sugar, that's all. Welcome the king of the dance hall. Pan bed, pan floor against wall. We sex them hard to them Bali. I'm the boys, them sugar, that's all. Welcome the queen of the dance hall. Hello, me body girl. Can I get a little girl? Your titty stiffy, remove your underwear and let me run with this little bit and let me Can't forget sex now a who that I ask my why? Can't listen to the question no funky guy. So I what so? Hey, in my act no shy. Me no big kitty, me like no bly. And why? Just to put your foot up high. Cause I, yes I, I can leave, you can fly straight to the tide. Between me, me, between your tie. Me no, but me no robbing guy. And you and I tell not no shy. When me still hear you reply, ah, uh, bite your lips and close your eyes. Pump the pump flow for them swap. We sex them hard to them body. And the girls, them sugar and salt. Welcome the king of the dancer. Pump the pump flow against wall. We sex them hard to them body. And the boys, them sugar, that's all. Welcome the queen of the dance hall. Okay, so. This was a very controversial topic we must talk about today. We're talking about the former, so might say still, but the former king of the dance hall. Yes, Beanie Man! Um, the Sharifas, have you forgiven your father yet? Because until you forgive your father for the terrible comments that he made of your sexuality and the terrible comments and the things that he have done to you in the past, Deja Ravers, unless Deja Ravers come forward and say, I forgive my father, um, we will still be watching Beanie. Nevertheless, of course, Beanie Man was always known as the king of the dance hall. Rightfully true. Now, of course, I'm talking about Bunty and all of these people and the, the real gun garlands of dance hall, but Beanie Man was known to be the king of the dance hall. It's just that, um, sir, I don't really know how to tell you this, but a new king came up and him now wear locks. <laughs> I wrote that, I wrote that last night. Last night I was in my bed and I wrote that. I was like, a new king of dance hall is coming in and he doesn't wear locks. <laughs> okay, but anyways, right? He now wear locks. His name is World Boss. Um, and when we talk about dance hall, this is not about who is in the industry the longest. This is not about who made an impression in the hit industry. It's talking about who the fans could relate to more and how our ghetto experiences could relate to the artist that is putting these lyrics on paper which is why we gave vibes cartel king of dance hall and we were we crowned spice as the queen of course before spice it was marilyn hall lady saw i wanna fuck you with my slippers on yeah right it was lady saw of course it was given over to spice and of course, everybody knew Beanie Man to be the king of the dance hall. It was given over to Adisha Palmer. So thank you so much for wearing the crown. But um, when we talk about king of the dance hall, it's Adisha Palmer. Nevertheless, we have to. Beanie Man sing hits upon hits upon hits. Beanie Man even did a song with Janet Jackson. It's alright. Can you feel it, boy? You can feel this feeling all around the world. It's okay if you feel it. Forget everything and everybody. Let's just have a party, me and you. So Beanie Man was, he was one of the biggest But Nevertheless, I don't know why Beanie wanted to come. He was not touching me in my sleep last night. No, but I was channeling Beanie Man. So for some reason, may I get Beanie Man, something I go on with Beanie Man. Is he a Scorpio? He seems like a Scorpio. August 22. That's not a Scorpio. That is a Virgo. Oh, Beanie, no wonder. Beanie, you and my father come in like the same blood clot. Man, no wonder why these Sharivas have a problem with you too. Uh, I'm sorry. If this are August 22, this are Virgo. Okay. This look like... You know what is this Sharia of a second myself and by you know? Oh a Leo, that's a Leo. It's not a Virgo. This Sharivas, this is even worse. Alright, anyways, let's go ahead and go into your reading. Um yeah, most getting Beanie Man. Most getting something about Beanie Man won't work with your father or something about your 
something about being a man and somebody else collaborating, making music. I was also getting something about keys, either a master key or somebody's going to give you a key to somewhere. I don't know what this is. Key to a house, key to a car, key to a safe. They're getting some. They're getting some more keys, okay? Anyways, let's go ahead and go into the reading. Either way, Gemini in pan bed, pan floor against wall. We them hot to them bali. I'm the guys, them sugar, that's all. Welcome the queen of the dance hall. Right? Jeez. Hello, me body girl. Air did air. Cocky no give me no hickey girl. Don't you dare. Titty stiffy, remove your underwear. I make me rum it, jam it, stick it to blood. Girl, forget sex now. Oh, who that I ask me why? Who's asking why the girls must get sex? Ooh. Let's go ahead and go into your reading. <laughs> Who are doing? Who are doing? Gemini. Gemini and I. The Geminator. <laughs> the Geminator. We have the initiation ritual coming out first. So is that a part of your ritual? You fuck fuck. Pan bed, pan floor against wall. What is happening? On the bed, on the floor against the wall. Hmm? Them so acts it's a fucking outside too. What the fuck is this? Like when Alicia Palmer say. You pop down the love line, bed and bedroom after bedtime. Me don't in on a granny business with a fucking other front yard sometime. Hold on, girl, you know for wine, girl, girl, you know for wine. Initiation rituals. So I don't know who's supposed to have sex with you or being a man. Are you initiating a new female artist? Because you were supposed to put on Kristen Tomlinson. Instead, you took her while she was high and fresh off um, um, Festival Queen. And what? She was getting a little gig from Magnum Kings and Queens and you impregnated her with a baby. This is how a lot of men switch destinies with women, P women. And this is how a lot of men who don't who need to know this. And, and sooner or later, y'all dumb girls can wake the fuck up that on the lovers doing magic on the, on the lovers bringing on the name, on the birth date, on the information to people so people can, can perform rituals on the initiation ritual. Even though DDG is looking like a fine father, you see how him fuck up arms um, up their life? Because she was supposed to be bigger than that and she was supposed to be bigger than him. It wasn't he with a little, little mermaid? That, that bitch gave up her blood clot legs for a fucking vice. This is what the fucking little mermaid do. And this is why people, when it comes on to acting, you have the curse of the actors. You need to know that. Enough actors in Hollywood can't tell about the curse of what happened to them after them take on certain role. Now let us look at DDG's baby mother. Because this is what I know her as now. What's your name? Haley? Haley Bailey. Haley Bailey, who decided to give up her voice for fucking legs, right? Because that's what she did. Because she was a singer, she was an artist, she was touring all over, and she met DDG impregnate her. And now she's still in her blood clot yard at gym. Gym is not something for hype about, sweetie. Pregnant women who want to lose weight go to the gym all the time. Okay, great. Who, call, who came in Ariel? Pod, and there we will walk. Where will we run? If we could stay all day in the sun, wandering free. Wish I could be part of your well, right, the Ariel Haley, Haley Bailey, yeah, the little mermaid, the little mermaid decided to give up her fucking vice for legs. Since she wanted to walk behind DDG so much, DDG gave her extra pair of legs to walk behind him, i.e. a fucking baby. Now, whether she's being a good mother or he's doing good by the kid, that is neither or neither. All I'm saying is this is a perfect example of women who were supposed to go further in the industry, but love fuck it up. That's why the elites don't make you marry. That's why the elites don't make you have babies either. Because you'll never reach your full potential because you chase it down a nigga. And chances are they're not going to be together the next five years. She's going to be a baby mother. Starting up her new career. She's going to be like one of the girls on Love and Hip Hop. Listen, ever since I did Ariel the movie, listen, things has been slow. And DDG and the baby has been taking up my time. But now that I'm back on the scene, I'm bigger more than ever. And I'm going back into the studio. She's going to be a Love and Hip Hop girl now. That's what the fuck she's going to be. I swear. Because um, she gave up her vice for legs. Didn't she? No, she's rolling behind a baby. She's rolling behind DDG. When last she do a project? When last she and her sister collaborate? As a matter of fact, I think her sister was the one who said she want to just be a big fat dog for lay down and get pampered. Remember our sister said that? Oh, sweetie, so your sister tricked you. See, this is what I have to understand too. And this is, this is the game. This is not against, how could you do this to me? Um, Haley, your sister was supposed to get pregnant. She tricked you. You, you take on the karma. 
your sister pregnant let me look on your sister if your sister pregnant um i'm getting your sister was supposed to be pregnant not you sweetie yeah she was the more she was the innocentish one it was two the other one kind of more provocative she more innocent to me as the innocent one get pregnant um what is i put that on my mama on my hood i look fly i look good right and sisters sisters can switch with you like like I, what i see tyler sister is doing with her tyler sister is not tyler let me tell you something with that body comes jealousy in a matter of your mother your blood clot sister you hear i see tyler sister aiming to throw her off board okay so shaban chloe and Haley. chloe born july 1 Haley born march march 27 that's it's not Pisces. What's come after Pisces? Aquarius? Yeah. The fuck? Aries. Oh, I don't know where the fuck my head was. One is Aries, one is Cancer. The Cancer, which is the mother, Cancer rule of breast and the zodiac sign. Isn't Cancer Chloe? I believe cancer is chloe so if cancer was chloe respectively um chloe was supposed to have the baby not Haley. Haley, yeah yeah aries you rule the head you are the emperor you're the entrepreneur and even though your sister might be the bigger one we're getting a you have the vocals and a you have the ideas because you are the emperor you are march 27 8 9 your sister number one so even though your sister's supposed to go solo Okay, so your sister is a one and you're a nine. You see, your, your, your career was going to end before your sister's career. That's the first thing. And the nine rule ending. So it's either a nine upside down is a six. She pregnant. So the nine, the ending, take out Chloe. Um, take out Haley. Chloe is supposed to go independently. She's a number one. She born July 1st. That's what it's saying. She born July 1st. She two years ahead of our sister, and two of them look like twins. They're only two, right? Yeah, that's a perfect example of how a man see a potential and him stop it. Because you, you have to understand that, yes. Listen, I'm a divorcee, okay, babe? So I've seen what y'all haven't seen yet, okay? You have to understand just because somebody with you, have a baby with you, and love you, it don't mean they never had other intentions. Somebody can solely be with you for the last 10 years to make sure you don't know, produce nothing for the last 10 years. But you're going to see that you're going to be tricked too late. Either way, a baby is always a blessing, and I won't lie. Haley, Haley, Haley's son even met me. Them are memes of him now. When him on the little slider, I'm having little head up. He's so cute, right? So well behaved. Seems coming just like she. So we're not denying the child, right? We love children. But we're just saying, this is an easy example of how somebody can swap with you. As bad as things is, Michael Jackson has never swapped with Janet Jackson. Him, they always put her, him sister beside him. Michael Jackson had four other brothers. Jackson five. Imagine how much time Michael for dead and swap destiny with somebody else. Tito just died. Probably Tito should have died a long time ago. Anyways, let's just continue the reading. Um, yeah, so initiation ritual. We have 11 11 again. The two sisters we are talking about, the twins. We are talking about the trading of destinies. The initiation ritual. What did you give up for somebody else to get something? You give up your vice for legs? Hmm? I, I gave up my voice for legs when I came to Montreal and I decided that I want to marry Mr. Wellett. But when I saw what the fuck this was, I decided I need my legs as fast as fucking possible. How you gonna take my legs? Nigga, I come from the same place you same boat come from. Even if you take my legs, I'm gonna find a way to run, motherfucker. So you 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 can't tend there tell the government to me disable. You can't tend there tell the government say I'm blind. You can't tend there and tell the government the lie you want to tell the government. Hmm? How she disable but she still a fuck? How she blind but she still fucking? Government, I would ask you the same questions. I don't know who right on the farms I'm a blind or deaf. Or what the fuck they wrote. Because to this day, it has been hidden so perfectly. Not even motherfucking tarot cards can pull this shit out, right? Cursed. Yeah, you get Chloe cur you get Chloe cursed, sweetie. Chloe is number one. Chloe is July. Chloe is a cancer. Chloe is the breast. She's supposed to be the mother, not you. Right now, right? But curse, that is the curse too. It's like when you live in one body. 
Do you share the same soul, anything your sister do you have to do? Or I'm getting that's what broke the soul tie between you and your sister. One only got pregnant, so you now we have a different karma. That is how you rid yourself of um, um, generational curse and karma, people. When we're talking about a real spiritual warfare battle, right? You don't have kids. You don't have kids, you will not be tied to this earth. You don't have karma to the earth. Once you don't have kids. That is what the Bible did not tell you. This is why Adam and Eve did not have kids in the Garden of Eden. They were told to just leave freely. And, and, and what the fuck did Adam and Eve do? They had fucking kids. They had Cain fucking Abel. And Abel slew Cain because Cain and Abel always give offerings to God. Right? So after God banned them from the blood clot, God and Eden, them still was worshipping God. Right? For show you how some of us women worship our abusive fathers and our abusive husbands. Right? After God tell them, get usher them out. Usher these sluts out. Usher them out. After God said, usher these people out. Una still did not listen to God. Una had Cain and Abel, which una tell the sons to worship God. And me don't know which one was giving the offering. And God accepted one, but did not accept the other. And Cain was so jealous of Abel, or Abel was so jealous of Cain, they slew him own brother. And you know what happened after? They had a third fucking child. And I don't remember what the third child name, but Eve said that this was an offering from God. The reason why Cain slew Abel, or Abel slew Cain, it was because the third child was supposed to be born. That's why the male child, they never start shit. The male child is always the one they try to use to replace the first and last child, but we don't start shit, right? She end up had a second child. After them, they kill um, Cain or Abel. And she said, oh, God, this is your blessing towards me. So me could I get another son. Why she never sit the kids down and say, listen, boys, I see that you guys are fighting and this is becoming very tragic. But God loves you both. Why she never say, you know what? God is, God is favoring one child over other. Let me show the other child attention. Why she never do that? That is how you beat it. People. That is how, oh, or you wait until after 33 degrees for have a baby. Ask, ask, ask a lot of Hollywood celebrities how much abortions they had, how much mis ask Beyonce how much miscarriages she had. Because that's how it go in the industry. That's why it not make for everybody. That's why some people kill themselves. You want to rid your life from the karma of this life, you cannot have a child. And when you have a child, plus you abandon the child, that's even worse. You will, you will feel stuck for the rest of your life. You'll feel like you're chained. You'll never find love. You'll never find happiness. And no matter how much money you get around you, you'll never be satisfied. Because you took on the karma of your kid. You made another photocopy of you with your DNA. So let's clarify and let's end the reading here. Initiation ritual is a debt card. So I don't know who you're fucking on the bed on the floor against the wall, but I'm getting hopefully them now you sex magic pan yo. I'm getting after you have sex with somebody, you feel dead, you feel empty, and you're not getting paid, so I don't know why you're feeling empty and dead inside. You're getting you're having sex or somebody wanna have sex with them don't have no soul. Or that's how them get back them youth. That's how them get back them soul. Them have sex with people who who naive. So what them do? Sex magic or the ritual. Eleven. You no, know, this could also be going back to me. Feel like it's like your soul merged with somebody else, and you cannot split from the person until somebody dead. Maybe somebody is chained already, and them need to be freed, but they're gonna chain you so them can get free. Eleven. Eleven is a magician. Magic. Yeah, me getting you and somebody bind together. Somebody I try to bind themselves towards you. The death card. I don't know if this is somebody who passed away. Me getting somebody I use. Them I try to bind them. Your karma is their karma. Your luck is their luck. I'm getting no the fuck it isn't. Because only one person here agrees with death. Program is a lover's card. Gemini, this is you. And curse. Is a four of I'm getting drinking, me getting you as an alcoholic, your son of a be an alcoholic, your daughter of be an alcoholic. Me getting on a fa line of family can't put on the fucking cup. When you can't put on the alcohol and you don't know when to stop. Me getting that's what's going to take out somebody. Then I use alcohol and magic pan yo. 
So it's either somebody that try to get you intoxicated before them have sex with you. They are intoxicated before them have sex with you. Or somebody that try to get you for drink or again. I'm getting alcoholism run through your family. That is the curse. You cannot put on the alcohol. You can't go sober for at least a week, a day. I'm also seeing you when it like... I don't know if seeing you sit down and you start drink. And yeah, I said, boy, look how I fuck up my career. I'm getting you a drink. Or somebody I eat. So, I don't know, somebody I try to get you very comfortable with drinking alcohol. I don't fuck with alcohol. Not that way. Not that way. Or I'm getting somebody a tamper with a cup. I'm getting somebody putting something in your cup in order for you for, I don't know, get horny, for fall in love with them, or for them to put you under. Okay? So maybe that's why somebody feel like after them give you, perform this spell on you, them can't fuck you up on the bed, on the floor, against the fucking wall. No, they cannot. They better keep on a king size bed with some little lit, lit candles. And I know you don't like when I bring up my exes, but um, yeah, you can buy one of the massage oil that Mahim did buy. That's scented, flavored. It actually gets warm when it touch your skin and it's edible. Are you into toes? I'm going to leave it here. Until next time, bye, Gemini.